What up, y'all? Welcome back to Free Fitness. Today we have another instructive exercise video. We out here in the park, feel me? We about to just work. You know, today I have a fat burning exercise that you could do in the comfort of your home. And first things first, be aware that half the time it's not even fat surrounding our body. It's water weight. And water weight is held by sodium. So you need to watch your sodium intake levels. Try to stay away from chips and any high sodium intake foods. To get the most out of this workout, your diet and nutrition is just as important as your physical health. All you need is your phone to be set on the timer, to be set everything for 20 seconds, and you probably use a list of the exercises just to help you out. First exercise are the jump tucks. You want to increase the heart rate right away. Next exercise are the push ups with alternating toe touches. You want to make sure that you reach opposite toe after you do a push up. Tuck your head underneath and reach for the toes. Next exercise, cross body mountain climbers. You want to make sure that your knee is going to the opposite elbow to help engage your obliques and work your core. Those are the in and outs. You want to make sure that your knees reach as close to your chest as possible. And you want to lock your knees out to 180 degrees. Next up, we have inchworms. This is an active rest, so make sure you catch your breath. Whenever you get to the top, take a deep breath and recover your breathing. Next we have Supermans. Move your shoulders as if creating the letter M. These are good for your deltoids and your back muscles. Next up, we have split lunge jumps. If you want to make more of a challenge, you can do the split lunge jumps without resetting. Lastly, we have lateral bear crawls. Working the quadriceps, the triceps, the forearms, the trapezius, and the deltoids. Make sure you incorporate this fat burning exercise into your daily routine. The exercises are made to get you tired, which increases stamina to work up a sweat and once you do those two things you'll be good to go